Only on two tonight, we're seeing a stunning new vantage point of the rescue of a driver in Northwest Indiana who somehow survived six days in his crash truck in the elements. Body camera video from several Portage police officers shows that rescues from their, their eyes, and you hear their shock that Matt Ream was able to fight for his life. Our Medibel Gonzalez has been covering the story from the very beginning and takes us through the video tonight. Medibel. Yeah, Erica, we've covered this story from all the angles. We were the first to bring you the 911 call. We interviewed the dispatcher who took that urgent plea for help. Tonight, we're showing you the remarkable rescue from the viewpoint of the people who made it happen. We do want to warn you, some of these images may be disturbing. There is a vehicle. It is pretty badly damaged. I'm trying to get down to it. It's going to be on the western side of the bridge. Body camera video from Portage, Indiana police shows the moment <laughs> officers first discovered Matt Ream's mangled pickup under this bridge off I-94 in Portage, Indiana. This officer sounding shocked at the sight of the crash and also what he finds inside. There is a male outside, a male's conscious breathing. Firefighters quickly jumping into action. We need you, Another officer's body camera footage showing him cutting the airbags. I'm going to start cutting back some of this airbag, okay? The 27 year old driver seen here pinned to his seat. We got you, buddy. We're going to get you out of here, okay? Nearby, officers on the scene processing what's happening. How long has he been there? They said six or seven days. Oh my God. Yeah. But, I mean, nobody would have seen this thing no. falling. Thank God somebody found him. Yeah, it could have been, could have been bad. It was these two fishermen who did find him and called 911. They're on the way, buddy. They're on the way. Now they're standing nearby watching everything unfold. I'm the one that found them. How'd you find them? We came over there and, came right. out and, and I told him there's a car over there. And I said, let me go check it out. Back at the pickup, an officer trying to gauge Matt's injuries. Left leg stuck under the A pillar. Yep. And then right leg stuck in between. Steering shaft and all that. First responders working to get him out using ropes and rescue equipment. I've never seen something like this before ever. All while others giving Matt medical attention. Can I get a blood pressure on him for you? After more than an hour of maneuvering through the wreck, the rescue. One, two, three. Matt carried out of his crash pickup into a stretcher, visibly in pain. Ready, everybody's ready. And taken to safety. Matt, don't forget to breathe, okay? Now, what you didn't see on camera, Matt handing first responders a journal he kept while being stuck inside. Portage police telling us he wanted to be remembered because he didn't think he would come out of this alive. Now, the other thing, his repeated requests for a Big Mac. Reporting live in the control room, Maribel Gonzalez, CBS uh, 2 News. Well, hearing that from the police officers and seeing it's pretty incredible. Maribel, thank you.